Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. Here in today's video, I'll go ahead and walk you through on how you can just solve your applications getting disappeared from the home screen of your old Samsung device. Here we have the Samsung Note 8 here. If you have any old device from Samsung, don't worry. Let me move on and show you how to solve the application goes disappeared or missing on your home screen on your Samsung device. So let's get started. Now to solve your problem, the very first solution that you need to follow is you want to open up your settings on your device. And right after that, you want to choose this application called Apps. Now you have to just tap on there. You got to tap on this trade dot here and now you got to tap on Reset App Preference. Go ahead and tap on there. It's going to give you a prompt. Tap on Reset here. Now simply get out of here and check your problem. Now if you see still you got the same problem here, the next thing we're going to talk about is your application itself. Sometimes if you hide any specific application from your app menu on your old Samsung device, then you're not going to be able to see this application on your home screen. So in that case, all you need to do is make sure to unhide that application or you can delete this application that you're using to hide this application on your device. After that, just go ahead and just try to see whether you're being able to get any application on your device, I mean the home screen or not. Well, if this is still you got the same problem here, the next thing that you got to do is go ahead and open up your application manager from here. Just choose the application that you want to add to your home screen. For example, I'm just going to go ahead and add this 8 pull wall to my home screen. So all I want to do, tap and hold it. You're going to get this option, add to home. Just tap on there and then you're going to be able to see application is now getting back on my home screen. Even if I move it, it doesn't really go away. That means my problem is solved and this is how you guys can solve your problem and get back your application right on your home screen on your Samsung device. So if you found this video useful, if you think so, go ahead and drop a like and subscribe to the channel. Thank you all for watching this video and I'll talk to you later. Peace out.